all beautiful and blessed people of God. I've been through a lot and this is not to seek empathy or kaluoy to everyone because I believe that crying is being strong. I've been through a lot this year. I've been exhausted and I've been drained and I've been feeling invalidated with people who I trust, people who I love, never respecting about what is happening with my mental illness, Be judged because you're just, you're just too kind to them, being abused. being oppressed <clears throat> I'm making this video because maybe I'm not proud of being a person with disability or PWD here in Philippines for my friends um, outside the Philippines but I realized how God is being so marvelous in my life. I have been so exhausted. I have been so depressed, oppressed. After my vehicular accident, being the breadwinner of the family, and it's all in my shoulders, and I'm just so glad that I have my brother Alan with me and you know at times there will come a point where you have to block you know or stop the people who are very toxic in your brain and unexpected people whom you whom you have expected to be your shoulders to cry on and lean on and I always just remember what God is telling us whatever is bad happening in our lives he will create something good from it and for all of my brothers and sisters who are suffering from anxiety disorder it's, I know, it's really difficult uh, for you to feel like being strong and fighting if, if you're having a lot of rough and tough times. If you are heartbroken and if you're financially broken and it's just very good and very healthy if you're with people who who validates your emotions people who praise with you Christians or not God will send us people who will pray for you and who will listen to you and who will validate you and I thought going to a psychiatrist is gonna make me worse and taking antidepressants is gonna make me worse but God made doctors to to extend his arms and heal us and I am going through some tough times and today it's my second day for my Abby's art mural painting and it's therapeutic for me and home is is Amigos Garden Resto where I can rest and I can express my emotions and where I can be so talented because my actual home is not a home and that's okay I have a father in heaven and I'm just so happy that I have a lot of moms here to guide and to hear me and to 
give me a chance if if I fail you just have to be surrounded with people who will give you a chance to stand and to to be okay and to let you know that everything's gonna be fine and there's gonna be a future ahead of you so thanks for for watching this video this is not again to collect empathy and to you know receive a lot of comments or DMs where you can um, show where you can say I'm sorry for for what you've been through I mean it's okay but I'm not really collecting attention I just I, I know there's a lot of people in the Philippines who are suffering from mental illness depression anxiety maybe and you are valid reading the Bible is the best healing and listening to God and even in your silence um, make sure make 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 sure to know that you're not alone god is gonna put you to a place where where you will be safe love you all and god bless you and take care